Hey guys and welcome to a new video! Today I have a very very expensive gambling coming up, like uh, if you remember we did like the 600 Exalt uh, Uber Elder Watches Eye Gambling, which was probably the top notch, the most expensive gamble that I have done yet. But no, until today, cause today we're gonna reveal 60 Pigwalt's Rills, uh, Rigwalt's Quills, right? And they're going for 600.19 exalts there you go easy clap even more <laughs> okay no okay another 600 exalts gambling coming from norsedo thought and he said bring me post chain four times and three additional errors and something like that okay so all of those rig walls they usually go for like nine exalts per piece non-corrupted okay so the difference here is why i price them for 10 exalts is they're all item level 80 and this is something we need to have if we want to get a skill chains and additional time. And all of them are divined to like good projectile damage stats. So here we have 48, 49, 45, 47. So all of these are actually pretty well divined. That means every recoil will sell for like 10 exalts is a total of 600 uh, exalt heronis. Why is there? Hey, wait a sec. Why is there a line missing? Oh god, now it looks good. Okay, plus the 60 Val Orbs, and then we have a total of spent 600.19 Exalts. The thing, what we want to have is, this is the list of corruptions that we can have. Can you kill my Uber Elder? Wait a second. After video. D&D. Always be nice to, to people that are asking for something. So, um, the best ones here, obviously, skill chain one additional time unlocks at item level 80 what we have 60 times in this uh, Pigwalt's uh, Rofit uh, chat. Pigwalt's uh, Rofit tab here, um, which goes for uh, three mirrors currently, which is about uh, the mirror price about 220 exalts, which is about 660 exalts for one of those, or more than uh, 800 for this one depending there's only two in the market at the moment and the bow fires an additional error goes for like one mirror this is like a fake cause uh, yeah if one mirror is 220 exalts 130 is a tiny bit cheaper i guess so about 130 exalts for this one and the pock champ is the scale chain additional time i have done this gambling once uh, like last league i think and i haven't I, I got one additional error but no chain okay so the, the thing is we're gonna vial these and hope to not rip too many because if it stays unchanged like the boring version of the Val Orb we still get 9 exalts for that one because the Rigwald's Quills are super expensive and since they are divined uh, for a pretty nice uh, projectile damage I think it was projectile damage yeah projectile damage they will still sell for 9 exalts so the question is how many good modifiers we're getting compared to the rips that we are getting okay because in the end if all 60 would be um unchanged the boring version we would only lose like 60 exalts and that's about it okay so enough talking let's grab a bunch of um these uh, beautiful red secret magical orbs and let's start right away and hopefully hopefully we're gonna get two chains that would be so good like one single chain would be profit here okay boring Lightning damage to bow attacks this is actually the highest roll, I think. I'm not entirely sure, but we're gonna price check this later. Nothing. Point blank. Nothing. 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 Fizz is extra lightning. Rip. Fire damage. Nothing. Nothing. Boring. Oh my god. Uh, rip. Rip. Fire damage to bow attacks. Nothing. Boring. Rip. Or uh, rip. Uh, nothing, rip, nothing, fizz is extra lightning, nothing, rip, nothing, rip, <laughs> nothing, <laughs> oh god, hey, why, why has this not 30% global accuracy rating, wow, fizz is extra lightning, rip, nothing, rip, fizz is extra fire, rip, uh, the nothing, point blank, nothing, Cold damage leeched his life, which is not bad. Uh, nothing, nothing, rip. Projectiles deal 25% increased damage for each time they have chained. 
Yeah, since Rickwald, no, the Rickwald doesn't give you chain, but you can get a chain in. But I think like this is the most valuable one at the moment. I'm not sure. I haven't checked this price here. So we have like uh, 12, 24 more to go. Uh, boring point blank for the third time. Another lightning damage to bow attacks. Nothing. Boring. Cold damage. Rip. Nothing. Rip. <laughs> Nothing. Boring. 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 Boring, rip, <laughs> and boring. Oh no, not a single one. Oh god. Oh. Okay, you know what? I think these vals, val orbs are bad. Uh, are bad. So we're just gonna render them. They are like full of shit. Oh god. I, wait, these five here destroy. Oh god. Okay. Um, definitely loss. Okay, I I can say that already. This is a loss. Okay, cause. We, we need to have a one chain or a one additional era to actually make profit. So let's check corrupted. All of them are corrupted, which is sad. Okay, so let's check here rare. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, let's put them here. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight is fourteen. Reaps. Then we have um, 30% global accuracy rating. These are the unchanged ones, right? So we're gonna put the non-highlighted ones to the side because these are the ones we have to actually price check or at least make a quick glance over if they are good or not. But I think there was one, but I think it was a rip, right? I think there was one rip that actually had uh, a 26% uh, roll here. So let's check point blank. Change, change, point, point blank, physics extra, physics. Oh, here it is. Point blank, and the rest is just, yeah. So, which makes a total of, oh god, ah, oh, no! Let's just throw them everywhere. Okay, so, let's get them easier to sort in here, and some more of that. So, which means one, two, three, four times two, four, six, eight, 32? 32 uh, is 46, means 14 have changed. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 3, 6, 9, 12, 14. Okay, so <clears throat> let's check the point blank real quick because there haven't been too many changes, right? So we have point blank goes for. 14 exalts, 20 exalts. Why are they so expensive? Eh. Yeah, pro like 14 exalts probably, uh, yeah, probably on this side here. So one, two, um, I think it was three, right? Three, three times point blank. The thing is, those have physics extra on top of that, so they are worth more, obviously. They're, they're all double corrupted. So let's just take the 14 exalts, what is right here, so... Maybe, maybe. So, uh, that's 14 and 14. Then we have Physis Extra Fire. I th don't think Physis Extra Fire is any good. Physical... Oh god, what's happening here? I don't want to print this page. What the fuck? So... Physical... S no, S Extra Fire. There we go. Physis Extra Fire. Easy clap. Uh, 9 Exalts. 13 Exalts. Why should somebody go for Physis Extra Fire? So, 9 exalts even with fire damage leech this life. That would make sense if you have some fire damage into leech on top, but to be honest, like even if I see here 13 exalts, 14 exalts, I, I don't think that this is extra. Like lightning damage, cold damage, probably, but not fire. Like, sorry, but I might be wrong here, but I would not give this more than a 9 here, to be honest. Let's be honest here, okay? So, this is extra fire. Then we have this is extra lightning here. Cold damage. That's something we have to price check. Price check. This is extra lightning. Um, this is extra lightning is twice. Wasn't there another fire one? No. Okay, so one times nine. Then we have the this is extra lightning. That could probably be a little bit more, but... These builds are cult-based, not fist-based. 
like rig welds. Of course, you can play rig welds with any kind of stuff, okay? And that would make sense, okay? If, if I'm having a pure physical tornado shot build, barrage, anything like that, and it's pure fist based, we're gonna get a lot of alley damage out of that. That would make sense. I, I, I understand that. So, fizz is extra lightning. That should probably be the same value then. 10 exalts, 12 exalts. So if we're gonna say, take it into account, then we're gonna switch both the 12 exalts here. So then we have this twice, it's another 12 exalts. These are the lightning damage, then we have the fire damage, then we have... Wait, lightning, lightning, oh, we have triple lightning. Is one of those perfect? No, only the fire roll is perfect. So that's the lightning, that's the fire, and that's 14? Wait, we have three point blanks. Hey, MBX, you're a fucking retard. Uh, sorry, I'm, I'm a family-friendly stream, okay? So, three times point blank. One times fire, three times lightning. Okay, now, now we got it. Well, seven, seven rig welds price checked here. So, then we have cold damage leached as life. That could definitely be nice. Because cold damage leached as life is really nice for, uh, like I said, like, uh, rig uh, not rig welds, the, the, the wind ripper builds are actually cult based builds. So damage leeches life is 10 exalts, 10 exalts. Double corrupt, single corrupt. Okay, probably not. Okay. Yeah, I, I thought so. I, w I would take uh, that one over the, the accuracy rating, to be honest. Then we have the projectiles chain. Projectiles, a chain, uh, a chain, something with chain. Any long text with chain. There you go. Twenty-five percent, um, ten percent, uh, ten exalts, twenty with a double corruption. So eleven. Yeah. Then let's let's do eleven. Okay. I thought this is more as well. Like, why don't you use this one with a chain? Chain support. Yeah. Maybe I'm just a noob. Yeah. I, definitely, I'm a noob. So double fire damage, lightning damage. So one time cold double lightning damage but this one is the lightning damage with the high roll okay lightning damage to bow attacks i think yeah there we go because if you're gonna check this one we have like i think three different lightning rolls the one here is uh 20 28 then we have the um the second one is here 31 and we have three times the 76 which is the highest roll here right to 75, 72. So this is something we have to take into account because this one is the mid roll, mid roll. That's the mid roll. That's the high roll with 23 exalts. Mid roll, double corrupt. So basically, this is would be the only uh, listed nine days ago. So nine days ago, probably not. If this one is 18, listed two days ago, 10 hours ago, questionable. Yeah, I just have to take what's on the market to be honest. So we're gonna take the twice uh, 20 exalts here. Because if he doesn't sell it for uh, 23 and the one with two days is one less roll. So we're just going to park it into the middle and going to see if it sells or not. Then we have the fire damage. Fire damage to bow attacks. Uh, what roll do we have here? It's the fire damage to 30. This one is the mediocre roll. And we have this one twice, right? Yeah. Twice the mediocre roll. Uh, we're setting at... 10 exalts, 10 exalts. This is the mid roll already. 10 exalts. So double 10 exalts right here. 10 and 10. And we're about to hit the probably most valuable one of those is cold. Um, yeah, cold damage to bow attacks. I might actually be wrong a little bit with the pricing here, but what you're gonna do here, right? So we have the 28 roll, which is the mediocre roll as well, I think, right? Yeah, here we go, the mediocre roll, and I saw one for 10 exalts, 12 exalts, mediocre, 14 exalts. So we're gonna park it here with like 12 exalts somewhere in there. So summary, how many do we have here? Another 183. So we have 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So... That means we have this amount plus um, basically the 183 that we're just going to calculate it. And we sadly lost quite a bunch of currency here. We made a, a, a total loss of 129 exalts, although, although I was actually very um, optimistic with the sell values of this quivered with the corrupted changed mod, okay? So I know that. So... In the end, 129 exalts down the toilet. Very beautiful, which is actually sad because only one single. Let, let's say we have one single rig vault with the uh, additional error, right? 
That would be, let's say, that 12 gone, and we have 135 here, which would be 306, and it would be almost even, okay? Like, only one single additional error would have actually brought the gambling to an even point. The chain would have been the ultimate win here. Sadly, it didn't work out on this uh, gamble here. So, yeah, back to the losing streak. I had too many win streaks before, so, yeah. Thanks for tuning in, thanks for watching, and see you on the next video.